Welcome back to Spore and Sprout. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to extract the beneficial compounds from reishi mushroom. This mushroom contains both water soluble compounds and alcohol soluble compounds. So we're going to need to break this up into two different extractions. The first step is to extract the terpenoids using a high proof alcohol. For this video I am using Everclear grain alcohol. Fill a mason jar three quarters of the way with the dried mushrooms and then cover with the Everclear all the way to the top. The jars will need to be stored in a dark area for 30 days and every single day you should shake the jar. After 30 days, it has been enough time for the alcohol to break down the cell walls of the mushroom and release the compounds into the alcohol. The next step is to separate the liquids from the solids and then put the solids into the crock pot to begin the second extraction with hot water.
The next step is to extract the beta glucans using hot water. The high temperature setting on the crock pot is a little bit too hot, so we're going to turn it down to low or keep warm and leave it there overnight. After 8 to 12 hours of simmering, you can now filter the solids and throw them away and then combine both the water extraction and the alcohol extraction. If you notice any sediment at the bottom, you can do another filtration with a coffee filter to clean it up. After combining the water extraction with the alcohol extraction, the total alcohol percentage should be at least 25%. This will help discourage any molds from growing on your tincture. Your tincture should be stored in amber glass vials to prevent the compounds from degrading. I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos just like this one.